some beer tuber. Um, that's uh, a person who reviews beer on YouTube, uh, not a beer root vegetable. This is Chamanka. It's a La Di Bosch collaboration done with Goutte d'Or, which these are both French breweries. La Di Bosch is somewhere in the southwest of France, I believe. And Goutte d'Or is in uh, Paris. So it's a black IPA and it was aged in mezcal barrels. The bottle looks like it's happy. There's nothing scary going on on the inside. God bless. Here's the label because I know you want to see that artwork. La Bosch has great artwork. Pretty consistently amazing. Oh, oh. Opening the bottle. It's always like the most difficult part. You know? All the aggro pour. Got a good head on it. Uh, oddly enough, on the nose, I'm getting just kind of like fresh wood notes and a little bit of piney resinousness. Is resinousness a word? I'm reaching. I'm reaching. I want... It's pretty. The lacing is fun. It even has like a little bit of a light rosy tinge to the head. And don't get me wrong, I drink a lot of mezcal, so... It's not that I don't know what those smell like, because it should technically have a little bit of like the maybe a sweetness that comes from agave but definitely more of a smoky aspect that's kind of well besides legislation and um, whatever territory laws that's what differentiates mezcal from tequila is that it's like a smokier flavor anyway bottom up darlings all right let's put it like this it comes at you with kind of a piney green sense to it. It fades into a very dark, almost burnt malt taste to it, like bread crust, but burnt. We've got that, not, a, not too much of like a coffee note, but when it gets all the way back, you have a bitterness that sits, it's quite dry. And then on the exhale, it's a little bit boozy and warming. And again, that just like, really raw wood, which is not bad. Uh, I don't know if I would pick out Mezcal if I just picked this up. Uh, the barrel aging does come through, and again, at 8%, that's perfect. Maybe it could have used some more time sitting, and it's fine. I'm gonna put it in the fine category. So uh, that's that beer, this one. I'm gonna go film some world <laughs> beer news. I'm gonna get drunk tonight. Yeah, that's why I'm wearing all this makeup. <laughs> uh, ciao. What am I getting? <laughs> I wear all this makeup even when I'm at home.